Hey guys, this video is going to be about some shake recipes that I do with my Vialis um, shake mix. So I've been requested to do, just to show you guys what kind of shakes I make, because like the options are endless of different things that you can do. So I'm going to share that with you. And I also wanted to just um, mention this. I've been requested like a whole bunch of things regarding Vialis, like the different kits and why you would buy each one and the prices and different products and just lots of things. So um, instead of flooding my Alhar um, YouTube channel with all those videos, because um, I know that some people really aren't interested in it and there's quite a few I need to do, I thought that if you're interested you can go subscribe to my other YouTube channel. I don't currently use it but I do have a second YouTube channel. Um, I was going to use it for my blog but it's called The Hot Pink Mama. Um, youtube.com slash the hot pink mama. I'll put a link somewhere so you can click on it. But yeah, if you want to know more about Vicealis, what I'm doing, um, different packages, um, why I like it, I don't know, anything that I was requested. If you want to know more about it, I'm going to post all those videos there, like shorter videos of those um, answers. So yeah, that's what I wanted to mention first of all. I did a quick um, video this morning just of like various things that I typically put in my shake, so I'll add that in right now. Okay, so here I'm showing you some things you can make in your shake. Um, I'm going to be using a blender, but you don't have to use a blender. You can totally just shake it up or stir it up or whatever you want to do in a water bottle. Um, every shake you have the, the mix, obviously, by shape, and you put in two scoops of this. I'll show you what the scoop looks like. Here's the scoop, and that's what the powder looks like. It's just like a vanilla powder. So, I'm not sure what kind I want to make yet, but I'll show you the kinds I typically make. So, one of them would be with this, and some instant coffee in the morning, some ice, um, and some milk, and it's like a mocha one for me, because I like to have coffee in the morning. It's the only coffee I have all day. So, that's one. You can use, I want to note, you can use skim milk, you could use rice milk, you could use soy milk, you could use almond milk, um, so there's lots of different options. You can also use yogurt, this is... Greek yogurt, you can totally use that. Some other combinations I like making are strawberry banana, so I'll put in like half a banana and some frozen strawberries and sometimes some ice and blend it up. Um, or I really like banana peanut butter, so a tablespoon of peanut butter, half a banana, milk, an ice, and I blend it up. So yeah, there's lots of different combinations. Okay, I decided to make strawberry banana, so here's what it looks like. It's just like the consistency of a shake. So yeah, those are kind of my go-to shakes. Um, if I'm doing a shake in the morning, it almost always has instant coffee in it because I feel like it just kickstarts my day. And anyways, but I really like the banana strawberry one uh, or banana peanut butter if I'm feeling like it. So yeah, there's also um, like a recipe that I printed off a book of recipes from Vicealis. Um If you're interested in this, let me know. I can totally just email it to you. But it's got lots of different recipes. Like I'll just read you some of them. Uh, and they sound really good. Banana cream, cafe mocha, chai latte, frozen chocolate banana, lemon lift, raspberry boost, sunrise smoothie, um, and yeah, they're just different combinations of milk or yogurt and bananas, um, chai tea powder, some of them have vanilla extract, um, what else do we have? We have apple pie, which I heard is really good. Um, and I want to try, it's made with, it's got some applesauce in it, so, and some cinnamons. So I think that one would really be good. Um, what else do we have? Peach Dream, peach strawberry cream, chocolate covered cherry, oh that would be good. Frozen cherries, with a little chocolate packet that comes with it, because it comes with flavor packs. Um, you can also make muffins and different, like, bars out of the powder, so it gives you recipes for that, like a blueberry banana muffin that you can make with the shake powder, which is interesting. Again, I haven't tried that yet. Drink special, so I guess if you're feeling like you're, I don't know, you're having a party and you want to do something special, there's a pina colada, strawberry lemonade, tropical paradise, root beer float. My sister has tried root beer float and she said it's pretty good. And then there's like um, dessert type ones, like um, carrot cake and chocolate peanut butter and key lime pie and strawberry rhubarb and holiday favorites like pumpkin spice which I also heard is really good made with um, pumpkin puree so I definitely want to try that. I do have pumpkin puree still in my freezer so that's pretty cool. So yeah it's just a, a big booklet of recipes. Um, I showed you kind of what I do. I need to branch out a bit and try some more things but that's uh, kind of where I started. So 
yeah, if you want to know more, like I said, I'm going to be posting all the questions about it um, on my other channel so that I don't flood this YouTube channel for people who don't care about my stylus. And I think that's it. So let me know if you have any more questions. Thanks for watching. Bye.